Hernandez murder trial. For the first time, we're getting a look at the defendant just hours before the alleged murder. NBC 10's Adam Bagney was in the courtroom when that video was played. He joins us live. Adam. Well, Dan, we all know where Aaron Hernandez was an hour and a half before the murder. That's not in dispute because it's on tape. Less than two hours before Odin Lloyd was murdered, Aaron Hernandez appeared to be dancing in a parking lot. Jurors saw surveillance video this morning of Hernandez waving his hands in the air, even though prosecutors say his next stop was picking up the victim, driving him to his grave. Judge, at this time, we'd ask to play portions of that video. <clears throat> the video was taken at a gas station in Canton around 2 a.m. the night of the murder. In the courtroom, you could hear a pin drop while it was played. Hernandez parks the car and exits from the driver's seat. After pumping gas, he walks inside the convenience store, purchasing rolling paper and blue bubble gum. At his side, alleged co-conspirator Carlos Ortiz. Around his neck, a towel, similar to the one found at the crime scene. I went to the front door to talk to my security to see where it was coming from. Also on the stand today, the bar manager of the South Street Cafe in Providence. She said earlier that night, the former Patriots tight end had patrons complaining because right outside, he was smoking weed. And I looked out to the building to the left. Um, Mr. Hernandez and the other gentleman were smoking on the corner of the street. Okay. When you say they were smoking, what were they smoking? I believe marijuana because that's where the smell was coming from. And one other note, sources tell me it's very likely Odin Lloyd's sister Shaquilla will testify tomorrow. She was texting her brother allegedly just minutes before he died. In Fall River, I'm Adam Bagney, NBC 10 News.